Hi, I'm Steve. I work in Dr. Flanagan's lab in the Department of Pathology at UC Irvine. Today I'm going to show you how to split human neural precursor cells. This technique involves coating a new flask with a solution of human fibronectin, lifting the cells off with cell dissociation buffer, then neutralizing the cell dissociation buffer with a 10% serum solution, centrifuging the cell suspension, and resuspending the cells in fresh medium, and transferring cell suspension into a new flask. In our lab, we culture human neural precursor cells by changing half of their media every other day, and we passage them about once a week by uh, splitting one to two. When I passage cells, I may count them if I want to play them for a immunocytochemistry experiment or if I want to do a transfection with a nuclear factor. It's important to use a cell dissociation buffer when passaging cells because first it's non-enzymatic unlike trypsin and it's much gentler on cells. Hi, we're in the tissue culture room now and before I show you what a confluent flask of human precursor cells looks like, first I'm going to prepare the tissue culture hood. First I'm going to turn off the UV